The next of our stellar matchups, Rebellion number 13 from the St Kilda Town Hall. And Mark Hammer-Castanini joined with Timo. Timo again, Ted Shipmanchai, someone you know a little bit about. Out of the famous Shipmanchai gym in Pamakaya, Kanchanaburi province, West Highland. Uh, he's a little bit when he a different Shipmanchai, they call him. He's a more technical, not only the low kick punch, uh, what is usually very, very uh, famous out of that gym, so it'll be an interesting fight. Well, I was fortunate enough to uh, to have the, the guys What's come down. Pech and Tia Sipmon Chai. Jason Castro uh, brought the guys down to do some sparring with uh, some of the guys, uh, some of my guys down at Hammers Gym. And uh, he was, uh, he put, definitely put on the show. Moved around with uh, my guy, uh, Chris Pitcher Harrington, and uh, really uh, turned it on in the sparring. And I can tell you what you're seeing now, you're going to see a lot more of Lloyd Dean. Uh, has had a great year, but they're certainly going to be tested right about now. Petch already starting to crack away at Dean's rear leg. Absolutely no slow starting for this tie. And uh, I just said he's not only low kicking and punching, that's what he's doing yeah, now. Uh, he's doing the lot. <laughs> he's doing the lot in the clinch. Oh, just takes the footing out. Nice right hand straight through the guard from Lloyd. Probably the hardest fight of the year for him, no doubt. But the heel consolidate, starting to attack the rear leg of Lloyd Dean. Of course, uh, Pitch, being uh, a southpaw fighter, is going to power up on that rear leg of Lloyd Dean. The rear leg is never going to be as well conditioned. The thigh is never going to be as well conditioned as the leg. As Dean gets caught, push kick up high. Another thing, Pet Tsipmanchai has a very sneaky head kick. He, uh, at Lumpini about a year and a half ago, he won three fights in a row with that head kick. Just uh, looks down and uh, kicks up high. The opponents have absolutely no idea it's coming. Once again, looking for that takedown. You've got to think, folks, the man in the black, black shorts, Pet Tsipmanchai, 18 years of age, just legal in, in, in Australia. <laughs> So 18 years of age, but already in Thailand has had over 105 fights. So certainly Lloyd Dean is going to be tested and uh, he's just got to get back to the corner to uh, meet up with Riddler. That was a punch, 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 that was a punch. Four, that was a punch. Four. Was a punch. Five, six, giving seven, him a, giving him a count. Eight. Saying it was a clean a shot, was a but uh, he was punch. up. Going to make things a little a little healthier for Lloyd Dean's scorecards. But you've got to remember in the scoring, if the judges had it uh, going pitch, just because uh, Lloyd's got the count, it doesn't mean he necessarily wins the round. So it's going to be interesting to see how the judges score this one after the first round, indeed, if it goes the, the duration. There was a takedown, and uh, Petch is capable of damage. Give him, a, give him a millimeters opening and he'll find it. Look at that push kick up high. Love the technique. Knee into the body, and you'll see the twist soon. There it goes, bang. A beautiful, beautiful position for the takedown. Lloyd now getting more aware and getting the weight into his legs, so he's not been able to be taken down. Just have a look again. Big knees to the body from Petch. Bang, he's straight through. And it did send him and down. The second and, uh, half of yeah, the round it was a clean awesome. shot. Yeah, okay. Awesome with that. Good, stand up, mate. Calm and composed in the blue corner, the Riddler. Just uh, seeing that Lloyd's gotten through that first round. And uh, he know he now knows what to expect. The question is, will Petch come back with more of the same? Or will Lloyd now step it up? 
Lloyd needs to get away from Penn. Otherwise, uh, there's more of the same. The low kick and the, the leg looks a bit damaged already, so Lloyd needs to try to get inside. Well, Sitman Choi uh, camp are renowned for the low, low uh, power kicking, and that's exactly uh, what Pet Sitman Choi is exhibiting now. Nice check. Now he's starting to tenderize the inside thigh, so he's gone to the rear leg. Now he's starting to go across and attack the lead leg. Oh, it's nice. Going hunting after that leg now. Sends him down. Sends him down. Power low kicking from Pat Sigmund Chai. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Hands up. Yep. Well, one gets the thought of if already his leg's that damaged, what else can Lloyd Dean do? The leg's getting brutalised by Petsit Manchai. Down low, up high, changing levels. Full ball, full power on those low kick attacks. Lloyd Dean, his plan is going out the windows, just fighting for survival, trying to stand up, trying to create something, trying to do something. Pets just wearing everything he has to offer and kicking low gone to the inside thigh leaving the rear leg alone now for a moment until he goes to the outside thigh just the slip but big heart from Lloyd Dean big heart is renowned for uh, his epic heart strength and determination Lloyd Dean the boy from Perth is certainly being tested fighting down hard on the mouth guard I'll let it go. Right. The again. He's gonna he's gonna try and kick out the supporting leg. Big low kicks. One gets the feeling, Timo, it's, it's just it, a matter of time. It's a matter of time now, yes. And uh, maybe Lodin is a bit too tough for his own good here. that Lloyd Dean could not correctly protect himself. He could not fight on with the skill needed not to get hurt. So he's called it off. And it seemed to be just a matter of time before those legs were so battered, were so tenderized, that they were unable to carry the Aussie Lloyd Dean around. Ted Sitmanjai, 18 years of age, absolute destruction, low kicking to the legs of Lloyd Dean. You can bet that ice is going to be Lloyd's best friend for the next 24 hours definitely, minimum. Definitely, definitely. Having a look at what went down, and it was just low-level destruction from Pet Sigmund Chai. That's where he switched it up to the inside leg. Yeah, he went to the inside, went to the outside, just battled all the way through. Felt the power of the right hand of Lloyd Dean in the first round and then knew he needed to take him out fairly quickly. Didn't want to tangle, didn't want to play anymore. Fit Sigmund Chai and uh, just went for destruction. Absolute brutality, low kicking. Have you ever wondered why the fighters target the legs so much? There's a classic example. Take away the legs, the body can no longer move. Gentlemen, halfway through round number two, your referee has put a stop to this bout, declaring your winner by TKO Fetch Sipmontai.